Come on, she's in the kitchen and she's real oh, busy. Oh, it looks so beautiful in here. Okay, I brought one chicken and Cook said to say hello to Foster. Hey guys, perfect timing. We're almost ready. Okay. Whew. So, I got a ton of ribs too, so don't worry about it. So, uh, it's uh, oh all God. gratin potatoes and asparagus with a hollandaise sauce. Whatever you say. Okay. Prepare to be impressed. Oh, oh it's beautiful, Liz. Uh, yes, almost a shame to eat. <laughs> oh, thank you very much. I'm going to help you bring out the, the rest of this. Such as? Oh. The carnivorous portion of the meal. <laughs> you thought I was cooking meat? The non-salad portion, I mean. Oh, well then, how about those ribs from Eli's? <laughs> Excuse me, but do I look like my nose is missing? You can smell those things from six blocks away. I just thought that you just thought that I would ruin dinner, so you skipped ahead to the emergency food run. Busted. They brought food too. Ugh. But you did. He told us to. You know, oh. I don't mind that you hate my cooking. I mean, so do I. I don't. This way, I get credit for trying, and and I don't have to eat it. He is so considerate. <laughs> so considerate. <laughs> that was an incredible <sighs> meal. Oh, if you are still hungry, you can have my end of the tablecloth. <laughs> Do they eat like a horse? The horses chew their food, my man. You know, I think I could cook all the time if dinner was just one thing, you know? They have one thing you didn't have to cook. Hey, food. don't insult her cooking. I didn't need her cooking. Oh, you know what? I almost forgot. Did you order a pizza? <laughs> she it's did. It's not Thanksgiving. Uh, wouldn't it be cool if we did this like once a month? Once a week? Yeah, it would be. As long as we always stayed best friends forever. Even when you move to Manhattan. I know we say we will, but, you know. Well, listen, this, this is how it's going to work. All right, Lucky and, and, and Liz will always be together. Right? right? Yeah, right. of course. Okay. And Lucky and I will always be brothers. Right. Right? So it all depends on you. You always have to be my friend, see? You can never spit in my face and tell me that you don't want to see me again. <clears throat> well, well, you can, but you can't mean it. <laughs> that will guarantee that the four of us will always be able to eat food that Liz didn't cook until we're 110. You know what? It is all clear to me now. What do you have there? <gasps> pretzels. Giant. Mm. Giant pretzels. Mm. It's like the ones on the street in New York. Mm. Don't look at me. I... Wait, you didn't have them flown in by a carrier pigeon? <laughs> no, 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 no. These are my contribution. They're local, not imported, but the bakery said they're authentic. Your expert opinion? Mustard? <laughs> Oh, um, yeah, I don't know how authentic mustard is, but the color's right. Mm. Mm -hmm -hmm. 5.6. So, are you going to tell us anything else about New York besides what you ate? Oh, yeah, we've already picked out the street we want to live on. It's called Horatio Street. Oh, it sounds quiet, perfect. But not too quiet. The buildings are all low, two, three stories. Mm. It's old looking, but not run down. That's, That's right. exactly what I pictured. You going to come visit? Yeah. You know, my agent gets work for me all the time in New York, except most of the time I'm too busy worrying about what's going on behind my back at home. If you're gonna come visit us in Manhattan, don't come to work, come to goof off. My rich brother will pay your way. He's very generous. Because my compulsive brother will pay back every cent with interest. He's a he's a regular money market fund, this guy. This guy. <laughs> you know, Liz, I really can't decide if I like them better as enemies. Man. <laughs> Look what I have. Here we go. Oh, sorry. Now, see, now that's something that came out of a real oven. Right oh, there. yeah. Carbohydrates are good with me. Don't ask me why. <clears throat> Protein that has to run for its life. <laughs> oh, wait. There's something that we have to do beforehand. It's something that my mom taught me. It's kind of like for a special occasion. What you do is you make a wish for your friend by offering them the first bite of your dessert. Uh-huh. Is that sanitary? <laughs> oh, I get it. It's kind of like a toast with yeah. dessert instead of <laughs> <Exactly>. champagne. <laughs> okay, here. Come here. <laughs> Friends forever. Uh, yeah! <laughs> okay, it's your turn, your turn, go. Okay, friends. Uh. Oh, no! Oh. <laughs> I can't move. More than friends forever. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>